Hello, I'm Assemblywoman Spade. Today, me and my daughter Madison will be showing you how to make masks. Due to the shortage of masks, I decided to make masks here right at home. I started making masks for first responders. I'm a police officer and I started making them for my colleagues. And I started getting requests from nurses as well. One of the first things you're gonna do is cut your fabric into 15 by nine dimension. And then you're going to fold your fabric inside out. And what you do is make a fold here at the top of the fabric. And you can stitch this part of the fabric. And then once you stitch it, you add the insert on the sides. One of the most important things for me was to make this mask safe. So I decided to add in a filter. So as you see, this is a room air purifier filter and I purchased it from Walmart. Another option for the filter is a vacuum bag. And I was able to purchase this vacuum bag from Home Depot. So most of the items I purchased was right from Walmart. So as you see, I purchased fabric, elastic band. I also purchased filter. I also purchased a stainless steel cable tie right from Home Depot. You'll cut two seven inch pieces as you stitch both sides of the mask so that it can fit closely behind your ears. And at the top of the mask, the insert will go inside and you can straighten the insert out. And the, the flexi bar that's at the top will go towards your nose at the top of the mask where the insert is and you will have a tight fitting mask.